Hello, welcome to Scrap Time, episode 1043. My name is Christina, and on today's episode, I am showing you the Chibitronics kit. Today, I am showing you the Chibitronics starter kit. And what this kit does, it allows you to add light to your project. So we have this card, and I press down, and you can see there's a light there in the middle of my card. So I'm going to show you first what's in the kit. Here you get a couple clips, you get two batteries, I've used one on that card, and then you get a bunch of white lights and then colored lights, red, blue, and yellow. You get your copper tape, and then most importantly is you get this book, the Circuit Sticker uh, Sketchbook. And what this does, it will walk you through um, how to set up lights. So it will tell you what you need, the directions, and then you can test it right here. So you're putting your foil exactly where they're showing you, and that's where the battery goes. And it will run you through a whole bunch of different scenarios. The one I showed you is to have a little light switch, this one here. So I'm going to show you here. What I've done is I've taken a piece of um, 12 inch cardstock and folded it over like this because I found you want to put your light on this side, not the side where your card is because once you light it up, um, where's my light switch? Once you light it up, if all that stuff was on this side, you're going to see all the lines. So I found I needed to put it on the backing and not on the side where my card was. So you'll see here, we have a battery, we have our light, and this division, and over here, that is our switch. And that's how it's not constantly on. When It only activates when this foil here touches these two to connect the whole circuit. So, I have another card here. Um, I have used the Written in the Stars stamp set from Hero Arts. I thought it was the perfect stamp set because it says things like, you light up my heart and you make my world bright, written in the stars. So I thought for adding a light, this was the perfect stamp set to use. And then I used the Pool to Navy Ombre um, ink pad for my stamping. So you can see here the heart is goes from light to dark as well as my lettering goes from light to dark. Now what I did was I made a mark with my pencil where sort of I want the light and where my switch is going to be and I transferred it here. So that's where I want the light and that's where my switch is going to be. So the first thing I'm going to do is take my battery out and on the battery you have a positive and then the bottom is negative and that's important to remember and I'm going to decide where I want my battery I find sort of up here in the corner so I could still close off all this for my card so I'm going to put a circle around where my battery is going to be Then you have your copper foil and you want to make sure you cut long enough pieces because you want it to be one constant piece. And I'm basically putting foil from here to here down to the light and then from there over. And the other tip was to cut your foil in half. It's a lot easier to, especially if you're going around in a circle or something. So I know first I need to go from my battery to my light. So I need about this much. Okay. 
And now, so here we have, if we follow along in the book, we have from the battery to where the light will be. So now we need to do the light to the switch. And that's where my switch is going to be. So if we get our little, this is little tiny thing is our light. And um, the point is the negative side and the long is the positive. So you have to see how this sort of connects on the page. So if I want the light there, I can maybe go straight down. Going to make sure that, yeah, it will cover it. And then now I need the piece from my switch to what will be the top of the battery. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a little bit of adhesive to hold my battery, but I don't want to cover that switch, that metal. And I'm going to put my battery there, positive side up, because this will be the negative and this will be the positive. So this piece is actually long enough. going to take my light and as I said the pointy part is the negative and the flat part is the positive so I want to make sure that the pointy part gets over that foil and the flat part gets over the foil and then I'm going to take another piece of the tape I'm just going to cut it and so this should go here and you can see the light went on we have success so what I'm going to do is that line I made on the other side is where this is going to tape. So I put this here. So then when I turn over my card, it says you light up my heart and you press it and our heart is lit up. Just have to make sure you press on that. And so the, this little book tells you step by step how to do it. It's really easy to figure out. You can do the little um, exercises in the book. And it's a great way to add light to your project because you light up my heart. Well, that's it for today's episode. Be sure to check out our website at www.scraptime.ca. And on our next episode, I am showing you the Mixed Media Handbook. So please join us. Thanks for watching Scrap Time.